I had an engine failure at night in a fully loaded gunship. I was assigned to the 101st Airborne Infantry Division. I was an artillery officer. Um, my first assignment was as a forward observer with the infantry company. I spent 30 years in the military, 18, 12 active and, and uh, 18 reserve. I joined the military from a family of service um, with the idea of patriotism, service before self. Um, I joined during the Cold War, so the idea that, boy, if we didn't have democracy around the world, we might not have uh, even the freedom to worship who, what, or where we may. Um, I served because I believed that um, people and countries that have more resources ought to be there to help people and countries who don't have a voice for themselves. There's a lot of veterans on the island. There's a lot of people that need stuff. And that uh, don't know how, about, how to go about it. I know where that lost place was. So. And, uh, went to boot camp in Paris Island and stationed at Camp Pendleton and had several, several different MOSs in there and was injured on several occasions. And went from there, got out of honorable discharge and I didn't even know I had uh, recourse, you know, for rights for being injured, you know, for a couple of years before I even found out. So my battle actually started in 1980, filing for disability. <laughs> 